Hello from Honolulu. Today we are fixing a airbag light on. There it is. On a on a 2008 Volkswagen Beetle, uh, and I'm gonna show you the code that is drawing here on um, airbags. Here, red codes. Okay, so this is the code that we are getting. 00591, seatbelt switch, left, short to plus. It means that one of the cables is broken. And you can try and solder it or fix it. I think the best thing to do is just buy a new part. And that's what I did, we're gonna change it now. Okay, 2008 Volkswagen Beetle. Um, we're changing the belt buckle. This is the new part. Of course, you have to buy all the new parts. Costs about eighty dollars. Um, original from Volkswagen. Uh, the problem is that it was giving the uh, airbag light on, um, and it was drawing a code. Of course, it was just a tiny little cable broken in here but you have to change the whole thing to do that you have to remove the driver's seat pull it upside down there is two 13 millimeters bolts down here that you have to remove and there it is these two and then you have to remove these two plastic uh, trim pieces from behind they're bolting right here and right there and those there are torques these torques what is it t20 to remove those then then the whole the whole seat comes apart and you have to disconnect these two cables connectors and then you have to remove the um, back hole and install the new one. Okay, this is the, the new part. This is what it looks like. And you have to install it like this. This is the, this is the um, seat laying on its side. And you have to install it this way. And you have to remove this bolt that has a special tool, it's called M8 it's actually a 12, 12 point, you have, you have to buy this thing as a special tool but you can find it for $10 online and it's called uh, triple square and it fits right there and you remove this uh, bolt and um, fits right here on the new part Okay, this is the new part installed, this is the M8 bolt and this is the cable, it goes around, there is a plastic clips here that this, uh, this plastic part comes with the, um, with the new uh, buckle and it, has, it goes around uh, here and actually it has a clip here that clips in around this metal part okay then there is this white thing uh, that clips into this hole this hole and then the cable goes into this clip here and then this other black clip clips into this hole here I don't know if you can see it right there and this one slides in slides in this way here laterally like this I can show you one handed and it clicks right right this way so this is the buckle connector 
Okay, then I like to put the, the seat in position again, but not not kind of tilted tilted back so I can reach down and connect these connectors. They go there. These are two. This is the new one that we just installed and this is the one that was there. I don't know what's that for. But these two connectors get connected there and there's this white that white hole there is where this thing clips into okay these are the two connectors reconnected there and now we're gonna put back the, the seats in position okay now we're putting the, the seat back in position you wanna put it all the way back and that wheel that wheel can get inside these slides and there is another one on the other side these are new buckle that we just installed so you put the seat all the way back and then you get the those wheels inside those uh, slides okay we are done changing the the buckle that's the new one installed and now we're gonna connect the scanner again and um, raise the code and see if the light on the dashboard disappears uh, airbags there is code are you sure? of course I'm sure okay I try to read them again hopefully it says there's nothing now okay nothing let's try and start here again See? The ignition. Oh, the thing disappeared already. Look at that. Let's see if it throws it again. Boom. No light anymore. Mission successful. From Honolulu. Jerry signing off.